An opinion article written by Vera Chidi Maha has an interesting line of question. Who makes a better wife, urban or rural wife? In her article, she shared the story of a doctor who took his time to flirt, date, smash and have fun with urban ladies and nurses around his dwelling and work area. But when it was time to get married, the doctor traveled to his village to pick a rural wife. So the question... Um, so this conversation hopes to understand why a man would prefer getting married to a rural lady rather than pick a lady from the city. We would love to get your opinion as well. So send yours via SMS to 090, sorry, via WhatsApp to 090 Please WhatsApp only. Don't try to call the number and we'll definitely take your opinion. Ife? This is a tricky one because I think it's um, based on what you want. As a man, you need to know what you want. So I'm not thinking about it from the angle of... Um, Maybe if I marry a girl from the village, so what, maybe. Sorry, what would you think a man who would have done everything I've said, you know, that you've done in the city would want that makes him go to the village, village to go and pick? I, I oh, think um, loyalty. Loyalty. Mm. So very, urban ladies don't have loyalty? No, um, loyalty to the tribe, to the roots. <laughs> sorry, I'm supposed to be quiet. Loyalty is broad. It's, very, it's a very ambiguous well um, word when it comes to this context so mm. i think loyalty in terms of everything oh wait like from the woman mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, what, yeah. what did you think she was okay. talking about from himself like he was uh, loyal to Igbo land or you're loyal to yoruba land or something so he wants no like, she a, said what would do i think a, a woman would do so right right, right. Yeah. sorry my bad yeah oh. so i think it's loyalty the fact that um I saw, I saw, I saw different comments on this one. I, this is that's why I said it's a very tricky one. But left to me, I don't think that I would want. To, it's about what I want. It's about when you find what you want, you would know it. So if I go to the village and I happen to meet a nice girl, and I can converse intellectually with you, hmm. and we have a level of reasoning, and we can live a good life, I really don't care where you're from. It's about my happiness at the end of the day. I don't think these people in question are wondering about intellectual And it's connection. not an I arranged think... wedding as well. And it's not that it is mandatory for me Wait, to marry the this girl. Probably your response is that it's not... Yeah, yeah, uh, I wanted to know what the mindset is. What could possibly be the mindset of someone who thinks that a woman in the rural area would be better than or one trust issues. Have loyalty. Trust, yeah, so don't have trust loyalty. issues as well. Why do you, like, what do you mean? You feel like, okay, when this girl is really... Um, well traveled when she's seen it or when she has a particular taste and it, it's a bit of so, it's, so it's, men it's a bit feel, of lack of confidence so in men, men as well small do you understand the yes they feel less it's a, ladies, i feel like yeah. a man who is confident wouldn't even have to go anywhere wherever you meet your wife even this if is, she's the professor if she has a phd if she has a master's degree you should your confidence level should be able to match hers and that's what will keep the relationship this is going. my theory so before I, you bring okay. your theory sorry there was a time this conversation came up not on this table like way back with me and some people and one of the things they said um was body count so do you think that plays any role as well i think it kind of plays roles as well because um you don't want to get a lot of men too it's also part of confidence <laughs> do not want to get married to a woman and they'll be like oh I, I, but he I, can I was do there what but he, he can, can have be, like no one is counting more. our bodies wow. like well, you no, see no that's a really can. unfortunate you see that my, my theory is actually tied to that i think um there is a problem an underlying problem with men uh, in general but a lot of them are in nigeria they packed they made them here and they shipped them out <laughs> one thing I've, I've noticed with the idea of sex i think it's a sexual thing for me mm -hmm. um is that men think that when they have sex with a person and they are devaluing that person mm -hmm. mm. which is weird because then what does that make you the a devaluer anyway different conversation a devalued person De but yeah the de devaluer because you're devaluing people mm. don't steal my conversations is mine please <laughs> so own it sis <laughs> so um there is a problem with that mindset but like i said different conversation if you then assume that you're in an environment where devaluing women is easy there's already a higher chance that you don't trust these people because you think a lot of other people are devouring you. And have you never Should noticed how people think that if, they, if they've had sex with you, then they think you've had sex with everybody else because mm -hmm. it's loose of you to agree to that person. So now everybody's carrying that mindset and that means that Lagos girls, in, on a larger scale of things, if we're taking Lagos as a, as a characteristics now... For urban. Yeah, for yeah. urban. Lagos girls are more loose. So then going to a place where it's harder to have women who sleep around and it's on promiscuity is not like promoted 
like it is in Lagos, and there's a higher chance that, that I'm was keeping in the someone past, though. This that's pure. Of course. Really? <laughs> <laughs> like, of course. I think that's in this theory. same article, there was a lady who went to the village and somebody gave her a soap for something that city girls are doing now. Yeah. Do you understand? So, I think it's really, it's it's a complicated situation. Yeah. If you also, ask me. for me, I think one of the things that um, plays in this situation is power dynamics. So, they want to still feel, they feel like if they stay with a woman that's well traveled, like you said, or exposed and uh, yeah exposure they feel like she 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 has a mind of her own already she can't be really manipulated mm -hmm. she knows what she wants she will stand up to you to tell you no or yes They're this is how we should headache. do it mm -hmm. yeah too much headache they for them they submission. can't handle Let's just yeah, say submission, submission yeah. is what they want okay so I, I think another thing that I thought you were saying earlier was, which is maybe the only positive sort of um, reason it could that possibly be. That still don't be. make sense because I think it does. I think it does to me. Where one? like the person maybe wants to go and marry from the village because from they're the more culturally um, aligned with um, that yeah, yeah, I think I've, I've seen guys that I've, I've met guys that their train of thought, you know, that uh, me and this one book, yeah, cannot align. You book. have to go and find someone who is it's grounded it's in, in tradition so that the person There's can absolutely understand you. Wrong with that. Yeah, yeah, that's fine yeah. but i think that's the only reason on this table now i'm comfortable with but every other reason yeah. i think men need to grow up and yeah. become um, better men become better men yeah be, yes, be so. man be, yeah. be a man i think i think it's, men, it's all about it your happiness at the end of the day i'm really not concerned whether it's a rural okay. girl or urban girl as long mm. as you're happy that's all that matters all right um think about your decision basically and do what makes you happy right mm -hmm. all right moving on to another hot topic so yesterday a female twitter user called out a male twitter user the lady said she introduced the guy to her friends and he went behind her back to smash and dump both of them they just realized they've been used so she felt the need to call out the guy because he had refused to pick their calls nor return messages sent to him in his response one of his tweets um read and i quote something happened online and you are bringing it to twitter some of your girls are unnecessary stupid. All your friends wanted to play with my dreads, and I gave them the dress willingly, end of quote. He also did not deny the accusation as he tried to downplay the situation with the help of his number of followers and supporters. So the question is, why do guys lead ladies on? Is it a weakness? Is there a high to the lies? Are they mentally challenged? Okay. Feel low, okay. I have um, <laughs> like I have a few questions on this topic. Okay. Now she said your MCM, right? Your man crush, right? That is, she did not specify whether she was dating or she wasn't dating this guy. She's not. No, she's not. She's she not, specified right? it. Yeah. All right. So secondly, did the guy force himself on any of the ladies? I believe not. Because no, he, he tricked the ladies. He like lured them into thinking that this was love. This was a relationship. And I love you. And then they give what their bodies. What gave you that impression? Did they say that's that? That's the story. That's what we know. That's the story. That's what she texted. And she, he did not deny it. He was just trying yeah. to play around conversations and act, oh, I was okay, a cool guy. That's, I was that's, used that's, as well. That's, that's the gist. That's, okay. Why yeah, is it that? Because she even mentioned in the, in the calling him out that, why didn't you just outrightly say you wanted to have sex? That was, that's the cocoa of the matter. Now, why are they going you know all the way to make that effort? Is but it mental disorder? You <laughs> 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 that one. It. But is it that um, at this time and age, ladies don't know when they're being played anymore? Like wow. you're a grown really? woman. No, really, you don't are. Don't make it a lady thing. You know what? It, it, it feels like you're saying we should keep walking around and it, hoping that every guy that says hi is out to play us. Yes, one. No. And so two, we should move around. Are you saying that issues? men don't get deceived or lured? Have you never been Wait, in a situation? I saw, I, saw, I saw it from another angle that, okay, what if you are the victim here? Yeah? What if you're the one that was objectified and used in this dumb? case? This that's case not, is not now. But, you, but, know it's but you know what? No, I didn't see the tweet has been taken down. I didn't follow. Okay, so I didn't see the tweet, so I just saw the conversation. So maybe you Why guys should give me the men, full gist. Let's leave the story away from the story. This is just like, what would they say? Power I'm not going so to answer that until I get Why? this because it's this is not the, about this is people. the backbone it's of just, the of no, the no, no, So this, this is the, general. The, has this not happened before this um, story? Maybe you should have okay, your take. Okay, okay, so what's your question? Why do men what? Why do men go all the way to, to lure the woman and then finally have sex with her? But you've given her that like love vibes, but then after the sex you go. Why don't you just be either straightforward and honest and get straight to the point? I think there's 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 something about when you get what you want. It's like when through deceit. <clears throat> yeah, it's like when um Eve gave Adam the apple, then they realized they were blind. That's how 
sexist to a lot of men too. So at this point, you're thinking like, oh, she's the most beautiful woman in the world. But you know, there's something about sex that is very dirty and nasty. It can be very dirty and nasty as well. So as soon as that is done and dusted, you're like, okay, she's not really, you start seeing her in a different light. That happens a lot. That doesn't yes. answer the question. So it's part of the reason why you might actually be honest with your, with your, um, what's it called now, with your approach towards the lady. But after you've gotten what you were after, or maybe that wasn't right. even what you were after. So he's saying that that's not the, that's not what, that, that might not be the plan. intention at yeah. first. Then but if but at the end of the day that happens, why like, is it that okay, you pull a bad It's not even like this, as well. that's you the problem, because off. I was going to get there. I'm now saying that it is the way you communicated to the lady that, look, I'm not doing again, like, I'm not feeling this vibe. No, I have so much reply. We are taking this hot topic again, and I think tomorrow. We are taking it again. And if I get your points ready.